Energy. Shout out my YouTube channel, Talent Talk. Yeah, um, shout out to Talent Talk. Thank you. Follow. Right then, guys, welcome back to a new video on my YouTube channel. As some of you might know, it's been announced today by John Percy that Derby have completed the signing of Phil Jagielka. Obviously, only a short-term deal with the circumstances that we're in. The EFL don't allow us to sign players on any more than a year contract at the minute. But it is a plus, you know, it shows things are starting to happen at the club. Maybe if we give some finances in, because originally we was only allowed four players. So they have allowed us to have an extra one up to yet. Official announcement from the club will be tomorrow. So that will mean that he will be eligible to play in the Wednesday game against Hull City. I know he's old, but for me, this is a good signing. If I'm completely honest, he's got experience. Under the circumstances that we're in, we can't just go for anyone that we want. We can't go and spend four million. You know, we have to go for free. So I think this is a really good signing in terms of that. I think in these first couple of games, Richard Stearman hasn't really been great. So I think I'd rather have a centre-back partnership of Curtis Davis and Phil Jagielka. I know it's not very fast. I know it's quite an old centre-back centre um, partnerships. However, you know, going into a season where it's going to be an odd one, we need this experience, we need the sort of passion, we need the leaders that these two are. You know, Curtis Davis shown that yesterday, uh, last season, sorry, when he was willing to play the last game of the season with an injury. They're the types of leaders that we need going into this season. Um, and I think the back four could be really good. You know, when you look at it, say if we were to bring David Marshall in back in goal experience, a centre-back partnership of Curtis Davis, Phil Jagielka and then Nathan Byrne and Buchanan, you know, I think that looks pretty... Um, Pretty good, especially when you consider that Christian bielik has got to come back yet. And then if we made a back five, that would look pretty good to me, you know. Considering the circumstances we're in, things don't look that bad, you know. We all thought that we'd have no players and stuff like that. So, you know, this could be a really positive signing for me. He's got the experience. He's been through ups and downs of football. He knows what it's like to be in these situations. He's been there. He's been part of all our pre-season training and stuff like that. So, you know, Rooney's would have made it clear how he wants him to play, what he wants from this season and all the ins and outs. You know, he will already know that. It will just be a case of him signing now, which is a plus, uh, sorry, a positive already. And he's played with these guys for a few weeks now. So, yeah, it will be. Um, also, Rooney still after Sam Baldock. Obviously, with Kazim Richards getting injured at the weekend, we need a striker, and he's still working on getting Sam Baldock in. Again, I know people are going to go, oh, you know, bad signing and all the rest of it, but fans also thought this about Kazim Richards when we brought him in. Give him a chance. He's not even put the Derby shirt on yet. He could turn out good. And like I've said already, we're under a transfer embargo. We can't just go out and get you know, your Jack Merritt's or anyone like that, we're stuck in the mud. Um, so we have to live with what we've got. And I don't think it would be a bad signing, if I'm honest. I think, um, you know, with our support, he could turn out good, get his confidence up. And yeah, you know, we, we need to give these guys a chance and support them. You know, we're lucky that we've still got players wanting to play for us. A lot of players would be probably looking at us and thinking, no, why would I go there and ruin my career? I ain't going to win anything. I'm not getting promoted, but these guys are willing to stick by. So we're lucky to have that. And for me, I'd rather have players that's wanting to play for us than people that's coming just for the money. These guys clearly aren't here for the money because we can only offer them contracts of four and a half grand a week. So they're not here for the money. They're here to help us out in the situation that we're in, which I, I support 100%. I'm, I'm back in that other way. But yeah, we've completed the signing of Phil Jagielka on a short-term deal, which we will announce tomorrow, ready for Wednesday. And we're still working on Sam Bulldog. So yeah, leave your thoughts below, guys. I'm interested to know what you think. Leave a like on this video for more. Uh, I will do a video when it's officially announced. And yeah, subscribe to my channel. Over on. <laughs>